It's a symbol of hate. I walked in and it, it just floored me. It just shook me that somebody could spread so much hate. I never thought it would hit me. This is real. Mm -hmm. This is real. Swastikas and the words white power were spray painted across the walls and doors of Joe and Pat Jude's rental property in Cincinnati. Police say thieves broke through an upstairs window during the Thanksgiving holiday. Then they wrecked the house in every way imaginable. They poured paint into the appliances. They poured, like my husband said, cement down the drains. I mean, there is nothing that is salvageable without having to totally refurbish the whole house again. They have that much hate in their hearts to take that much time to do this. This isn't the first brush with racism that the couple has had to endure. We got married at a time when, you know, it wasn't real acceptable. In 2010, their son Jay committed suicide at the age of 16 after the family says he was bullied for being biracial. Got through that. You know, I mean, you never get over it, but then you come in here and it's the same kind of stuff, you know. It's just not necessary. The family created a GoFundMe page to raise money for the deductible. They've raised far more than that. We don't want to live in a society that that uh, allows this type of fear to create havoc. Despite their place being trashed, the Judes are able to rise above the hate. Everybody's not like this. You know, you, there are those people that are, but you just have to give everybody a chance.